Hey guys, I'm Dr. Russo, fashion and lifestyle expert. I have a really exciting look today for you. Um, I'm incorporating a lot of different things. I'm doing stripes, I'm doing bright neon colors, and floral prints. So that's a lot happening, but I really want to show you how you can make it work. So what I started with was this cute little sweater. It's a uh, neon yellow and gray sweater. It's from The Gap, so it's pretty inexpensive. And what I did was I took the uh, major color from the sweater, the yellow, and I tied it into a floral print skirt that I have. So I'll show you the skirt. Just so you can get a better idea, this is the skirt, and it has a little ruffle on it, so it does have a nice little flow to it, and it's a little bit shorter. I like to do a shorter style skirt, just because I feel like it works really cute with a heavier knit sweater. This one's really nice. The key to this is that the yellow in the skirt matches the yellow in the toe. We're pulling those colors in together. And the gray tones it down a little bit. So those are kind of the key factors you want to think about when you are kind of mixing a lot of different prints and colors and styles and everything somehow ties it together. I always like to add a nice belt to the look because the belt ties everything in together First it ties the seam together, but then it also brings the top and the bottom together. Since the bottom does have a little bit of a black pattern in it, here and there, it works really well. To finish off the entire look, I kind of went a little extreme with a black booty. Now you could just do a little sandal, thicker strap shoe, or um, just a regular pump, but I chose to do a booty just because I feel like it makes it a little bit more wild and funky. You don't have to do this. This was just kind of taking it to the next level a little bit more extreme. So I know this look may be a little bit extreme for you guys, but it's sort of a really branching out and taking it to the next level. And you can play with it your own way. Do a solid on the bottom if you don't feel Or try just your floral print skirt with a solid top. That always works well. Just remember to make the colors work. The colors work, everything else tends to work a little bit easier. And then ground it with a really nice basic color, like a, like the black or a neutral, like I always, always tell you guys to do. Uh, my accessories were also very simple. Just a bunch of leather bracelets and a leather glam rock watch black which also ties everything in really well and that's basically the whole look I didn't do too many accessories you could kind of do a really bold necklace if you wanted to um, to be even more extreme and super trendy that's the whole entire look I hope you guys like it uh, the skirt is actually a really old skirt from um, a long time ago that I've had forever in my closet and this cute little bow belt is from black house white market but like I always tell you guys um, I'm on the app pose which is on the iPhone I think it's on every uh, Android and everything like that but then it's also on a website uh, pose.com so you can find it there too I list everything everything I'm wearing shoes sweater skirt jewelry all of it's listed there so it makes it really easy for you guys to find the whole entire look so come find me over there uh, at Dawn Del Russo or on Twitter Dawn Del Russo or my blog my intimate affair fashion I'll see you guys soon have a great day bye